There is nothing wrong with your video. There is no need to refresh the page. We are now controlling your experience. We can deluge you with concept images or expand one single stream to 720p and beyond to 1080p because that's the highest we can record at currently. You are about to witness the evil and corruption that reaches from the developers inner fan minds to the gamer masses. Okay people, guess what? It is time that they have released the War for the Overworld Bedrock Beta. We have been waiting for this game for so long. We've been waiting for the spiritual successor that this game is going to be for, oh, years, years. I mean, it's been oh, over 10 years since uh, the DK2 was out and people were playing that. Um, yeah, we've been waiting for this for so long. Um, let's just jump right in. Let's see what's actually available to us. A sandbox mode, so obviously you can do what you want. Uh, a godly conflict mode. Let's check that. That one looks intriguing to me. Nice to see the cultist there. Um, and the blood imp. Uh, hopefully the blood imp actually still has that name. Uh, one would hope that the blood imp still has the name. Because there's a lot of controversy over whether this, this object here is going to be called... Well, a uh, sanctum a nexus or a core. I want core personally. I want that to be its name. Um, been voting on the forums, lots of people have voted. Um, there's a few other options but it's certainly those three that are becoming the clear contenders for uh, for the for the new name. The devs wanted nexus, I'm not too keen on that to be honest. Sorry devs, just not happening. Um, yeah, hopefully core. Apparently not going to be the greatest idea for having a dungeon heart, which is a shame, but I'm betting there'll be a mod out there eventually because this game has been introduced to allow modding right from the off. Now, I'm looking at this and we have a limited amount of zoom, just zoomed out there, which is good that you can zoom out, but I would have liked some more. It's also pretty dark. Uh, how, what's the level of the zooming in so far that they've got to? It's a bit jumpy. We can get quite close. Let's see what the... Uh, isn't a control for rotating the camera at the moment. Uh, okay, so that's home and end are also zooming in. Oh, page up and down. I see. Page up and page down are rotations. That's good. That's good. Okay. So we can understand where we're going there. Let's have a look down here, what we got. That looks very, um... Oh, you sort of... Um, for me, personally, I'm expecting the pickaxe to be the point. Yeah, very... Very confusing there, where the pickaxe is one minute and... Okay, so... Possibility for a lair... Slaughterhouse, we have micro piglets now, people. Micro piglets are actually stalking your dungeon. This is not the way I want to go. Let's let's not let's not cut that out yet. I'm a big fan of my five by five rooms. Very difficult to get a 100% accurate hit on what you want at the moment. But you know it is sort of alpha. Oh. Okay, well, I could have a portal that way, I suppose. That's going to happen. That's good. Uh, what else has got here? Yeah, it's pretty difficult to see exactly what you want here. Do we have any options? Let's have a look. Uh, quit into desktop, okay. Continue in the game or quit to the main menu. Well, I'd kind of like to be able to adjust some brightness settings or something. I mean, I'm probably going to clear this up a bit so viewers are going to be able to see this nice and easy, you'll be alright there. But for me, this is pretty difficult. Okay. What's, what's, oh dear, right, okay. So it's best to hover over this area if you want to do anything in this menu down here. What's this gold? I'm clicking gold. I'm clicking a dollar sign. Nothing. Okay. Right clicking it, just 
I can slap a button. Slapping a button, people. Slapping a button. Right. I, I didn't right click that. Uh, it needs to be a claim tile, doesn't it? Come on, you remember how this works. Oh, hello. Hello. Yep. That's it. Do your little dance. Wow. Awesome slide there. Whoa. Don't slap the imp until I tell you. Calm down. Was that an idle animation? Is that what they've done? If that's an idle animation, I like that. As long as it's a bit confusing, though. Are you slapping an imp or not? Okay, right, so... Money. Needs money. Oh, oh. What's happening here? He's going to claim it. This is what we're waiting for. Let's see what they've done. What's it going to look like? Go on, son. Claim it. The viewers are waiting. As am I. Come on. Come on. Claim the portal. For evil. For the underworld. Claim that portal. Oh. Did that just change colour slightly? Right, why are you digging? Oh, right, you're... Ah! They're reinforcing, are they? Okay, they're, they're digging, but apparently they're reinforcing. Okay. On the upside, we have got the um, tile claimed and reinforced wall claimed dots and diamonds. There was an issue there for a while where they didn't appear to show up. But they're back. So if, has, he's done his dance. Does that mean that that's now claimed? I mean, there was no indication. I'm going to go with it being claimed. One would hope it's claimed. Okay, so. We've got a lair. There's not a lot we can do with a lair right now. There is some gold there, though. I can't... I don't understand. What, what are these arrows? What are these arrows for? I'm going to go with this being gold, because obviously I've got none. And, you know, it's the right sort of colour. Gold and gold. Music is beautiful. Music really is beautiful. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah, oh, bugger. Okay, yeah, I wasn't exactly planning for that. I, I like having one entrance. Wait, all right, that'll do for now then. <laughs> Let's get rid of that. Five by five. Hello, hello. What are you? An ogre? An ogre? Where are you? Come here. What, what do you look like? Let's have a little look at you. He's got a limp. No, he's smoothed out a bit. There we go. Did you just nick some of my money, mate? Because, you know, that ain't funny. Now, we used to be able to pick up gold. Has that been introduced yet? No. I will say right now that, unfortunately, I know I'm going to get moaned at, but I did not play DK1. Sorry, it just didn't happen. Didn't play it. Didn't even know about it. It was actually Exile that showed me the existence of DK2. Um, shame he's not here to see this. But uh, he's got other things going on at the moment that are keeping him away. But I dare say as things go on, he will be back. And uh, probably have some multiplayer stuff uh, going on. Hopefully, once they introduce that into the beta. They have confirmed that eventually that will definitely be happening. Are they the same bed? Or are they slightly different? They look like... Ah, oh, that's a cultist! That's why! There's a cultist. Hello, he's doing a runner. Right, come here. Slap the cultist. Slap the cultist. No, not, not, not slapping. I can't slap the cultist. Uh, that's fair enough. One day, one day, one day. Right. So we've got a lair. Let's see if we can finish this off. Because... Okay. Bit of a lag glitch there. No idea about... I am actually clicking and dragging in that area. But there's no... There's nothing to tell you whether you can or cannot place that room. Currently. Which is a shame. But that's okay. That's okay. And definitely not able to slap creatures just yet. Fair enough, fair enough. 
as, as we know, this is early, early alpha stage. It's not, it's not anywhere near complete. Oh dear, that's that's not. We're not going that way then. Uh, off of the uh, main area. <laughs> we, we shall we shall ref refrain from actively naming that at the moment. Off of the main area, let's go this way, five by five, and let's have ourselves less of a glitch, please. Let's have ourselves a slaughterhouse, if we can get that building. I definitely claim the portal then, because obviously we've got creatures coming through, and that's key to any success that we might want to have in this game. Hello, what are you? What are you? No, that's the goblin I saw before, isn't it? It's not a goblin, sorry, that's a lie. Goblins don't exist in this game, because that would be... No, that would be a wall of gold. Goblins are, are, are in DK2, and that would be a copyright infringement if they use that. So that would be a gnarling then, I would assume. I'm going to go with it being an island for the time being. Might be totally wrong. Okay, we now have four different beds. So we've got a cultist, an, a gnarling, an auger. What are you? What are you? What is that? That might be a gnarling then. Can you turn around please, so I can see what's going on? Stop standing still. Can't slap him. Okay, here he comes. No, don't, don't walk off, don't walk off. Ugh. Okay, middle, middle scroll button, middle mouse button. That's what we need, guys. Devs, middle mouse button and a quick spin. Right, so can we build the rest of this layer yet? Okay, right, rest of the layer built. That's, that's that part done. I can't pick up creatures, so I can't pick up any imps to get them to do this area quicker. But yeah, there's definitely nothing to tell you whether you are or are not able to place what you're aiming to place. Which is a shame, but early alpha or bedrock beta, the bedrock of the game. The main concept is all fixed and sorted out. There's a huge issue apparently with memory and that's what delayed the beta twice. It delayed the beta once, there was one other thing that just weren't ready to put out the, the beta at the time. So uh, yeah, it was delayed twice. And that's how eagerly we've been anticipating this. Every time we thought it was just on its way, it wasn't. Which was a shame, but nevertheless, it's now here. And the, the imp claimed some of the room and left the rest of the room. Can you go back? All of you imps, get... No, stop. Don't worry about the gold, look. Don't worry too much about the gold, come on. I need the rest of this room sorted, please. I'm gonna dig that hole through. Because it's pointless just having one tile there. There we go, wall down. Now claim. Yes, do your dance. Do your dance. Oh, now all of a sudden there's three of you dancing. Great. Nope, not the, not the lair. Slaughterhouse. And on that one. There we go. So these are little huts. Where, oh my goodness me, look at that. There is a micro piglet. There are micro piglets now stalking my dungeon. Beware. Look at that. Micro piglets. Cannot slap things still though. Go on, Auger. Go on, Auger. Take it. Grab a piglet. Now the concept for the Auger is that the... Uh, Arms are going to be able to, their weaponry, their attached metal is going to be upgradable. And over time, when they're salvaging parts from the bits and pieces from the battle area, 
and other bits laying around didn't want that selected um, other bits laying around just anywhere they can pick them up and they can go to the foundry hello what are these what are these yeah they can go to the foundry and they can upgrade their weaponry basically which is good along with obviously leveling themselves up now him doing his little dance um yeah what else what else is happening in this development God, I, 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 I'm honestly drawing a blank so much. It's like I haven't. It's not that I haven't got anything that I can say. It's just I cannot think of where to begin on this. How about my, at my dungeon something miscellaneous that's important. So yeah, big controversy over this. Very confusing as to exactly what it's going to be. I'm unsure exactly why they can't use the name Dungeon Heart, but yeah, as I said. Potential legal issues, so it's going to be called something else. Right. Let's see if we can put a treasury in somewhere. At least I'm assuming it's going to be, I think it's called a treasury. Pretty damn sure it's called a treasury. Uh, that one, that one, that one's going to leave us a hole, so I'm not doing that. Solid. For the time being, that'll do for a room. I'll get rid of some of that gold that can then go in the treasury, I suppose. Right, claim tiles all the way to here. Reinforced walls. Can we get this dugout, imps? I know I'm giving you lots of stuff to do, but... Is there a command queue? Are you going for these areas first? Because I don't need these now, at the moment. Well, they can't get to that anyway, so they're not going to be able to. What are these? Got Narlins and we've got something else. I'm going to have to figure out the names for these things. Okay, so... Ah! Ah! Maybe that's to pick them up. No, that's possession. Hello, that's possession. Oh, possession. This was always so... Oh dear. Right, don't jump. There is no jump. So it might be a bit confused because you're going to be a little bit more confused. I'm about to jump back into you. There we go. Yeah, it was always so glitchy and jumpy in DK2. No matter what I did, no matter how, I, what settings I had things on, it was always it's very, very jumpy, and very, very rapid. This definitely sounds like an auger. Thump, thump, thump. Hello, micro piglets. We're gonna look up close at the micro piglets. Come here, micro piglet. Wow, you can slide well. This is, this is just not conducive to good viewing, is it? Have a foot. Foot! I foot your piglet. Come here. No. Right. I'm out of here. Jump. Spacebar. Let's find a cultist. See if they're not quite so noisy. Ah! Come here. Come here. Come here. What are you? You're like some bat thing. Oh, hang on. Why does he sound metallic? Oh. Okay. Uh, this this is this is definitely an issue. You need to be able to have the camera sort of more towards the front of the creature you're possessing. Or just have it block out the actual model. And just have feet. Because this is this could did I just walk through here? It's very disconcerting. Yes, I, I basically just walked through the auger. So, you can walk through... And beds. You walk through beds. Cultist, come here. Jump. Yeah, let, I'll let you carry on. Do what you want, mate. Cultist, let's try you. I am hoping for a spell for creating gold somewhere in the veins. Ah, oh, don't jump! And annoyed myself. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Oh. Select. Right, select, and then come on into the cultist. There we go. 
yeah, veins, veins. We have sloth, wrath, and a big hole. Don't go in there. Sloth, wrath, and what's the other one? Greed. Greed. And that's a very interesting mechanic that's going to be introduced. Can we, can we get some light up in here, please? Imps. Are you floating? You are a floating piglet. Whoa. Okay, a necromancer has been around here. These are all spiritual. These are just ethereal piglets. Ethereal bit with very hypnotizing tails. Hello. There's an issue. Was it call to arms? Have we broken through somewhere? Why is the cultist like a worm? Blood imps. Come here. What, what is this with the ringing? It's the bells. What's going on with the ringing? Have we broken through? Because that's what I was asking them to do. Right, they're supposed to be breaking through. Fair enough. I really don't know what the hell the ringing is. And that is bugging me slightly. Right, treasury. Wow. Okay, that was an enjoyable surprise. That torch is a bit of an issue. That's definitely the lighting needs to be sorted there. But, never mind, as like I said, pre-alpha. But look at this. I don't know why I really like that texture, but I do really like all of these textures that's gold that's not the same I mean gold is nice but look at that there's even a little treasure chest that reminds me of Guild Wars so much right there that is a Guild Wars chest this ringing don't worry I mean hopefully I'm gonna be able hopefully I'll edit this out so you won't be hearing the amount of ringing that is going on right now I'll try and drop the audio of it down a bit major lag there okay can, can I just make is it payday is that the concept here no it, it's it's I don't even know. Okay. I've now I've now abandoned the concept of specific size rooms just to the simple fact this ringing is doing my head in. So I want to get uh, these other two things down. These other two rooms. We've got the archive. Not a library. No libraries. We've got the archive. And the f foundry. I'm trying to find a place that might be suitable for the foundry. Let's try there. Come on. Just let's get this place sorted and claimed. Can we claim this one, please? Over here. Come on. Dig it out, claim it. Where are the rest of my imps? What are they doing? Do your dance. Do your dance. Yes, there we go. So I wonder, is the uh, archive supposed to be a small room? It doesn't look like we've got any more furniture popping up. I mean, the slaughterhouse, that, that pretty rapidly jumped into having more huts for the piglets. Oh no, there we go. Ah, so it's set to be a rather large room. Let's have a look here. See if I can spin that round. Really looking like nice texture. It's ever so slight on the issues, but it's not that bad. I mean, so minor, it, you'd never notice it even if this was a finished game. Let alone with it being in alpha. Well, bedrock beta. So yeah, wow, just, I'm really loving it. 
that glow is looking good as well and this ringing is getting on my nerves I really hope I've managed to actually kill this for you because bringing out the uh, ringing or at least limiting it a bit so it's not screaming in your ears okay do we have this whole dug yet no okay you trying to take gold to the coffers Treasury, did I build the treasury? I swear I built a treasury. Yes I did, because that was where I liked the textures and they haven't filled up the dungeon important miscellaneous yet. So it holds quite a bit of money. Right, I'm actually going to call this for the time being because the ringing is getting on my nerves and if you can hear it after, after I've done the editing and that it's going to be getting on your nerves too so I'm going to call this for the time being and uh, I will be back with the uh, other side I'm going to go into the sandbox next so for now bye bye YouTube